Hello and welcome to this weekend edition of the Daily Dose of Greek. And today I want to mention a classic resource, which some of you may want to buy, but at least it will be good to be aware of. It's called Biblical Words and Their Meaning. It's a text entitled Biblical Words and Their Meaning, An Introduction to Lexical Semantics. It's by Moises Silva, and I'm holding here the revised and expanded edition next to the original edition right here. You can tell by the cover it's it's dated. I think it came out in the late 80s, the early, early 90s. Um, and yeah, it's dated, but it's really well done. It, it just, in terms of understanding words, what they mean, how their meaning changes, and just um, how that works in different languages, is just, it's just so well done. Um, I've used this book in a, a seminar several times, and students really enjoy it. So uh, I know there are more up-to-date resources out there, but this one is just really good about understanding how do I really know what a word means and how words change in meaning and so on. The author of this, Moises Silva, um, when I hear the name Moises Silva, I think to myself, there's, there's a man who I can trust for his reflection on the Greek New Testament. Very careful, a very good exegete. He's written numerous commentaries and books, another one, Explorations and Exegetical Method, Galatians as a Test Case. Uh, you may know him through that uh, standard reference work, the New International Dictionary of New Testament Theology and Exegesis. I look at it, it's right over here, it's five volumes. It's That's my first recommendation for pastors for a Greek reliable Greek word study tool for pastors is the New International Dictionary of New Testament Theology and Exegesis. So. Interestingly, whenever I, I say the name Moises Silva, I can't help but think about his nephew, Andy Vincent, who oversees the facilities here on campus. Andy has been working here 25 years or so, and we just were chatting one day, and uh, he's I think he's vice president or associate vice president over facilities or operations, and he told me that his, his uncle was Moises Silva, and I just felt like I had met the nephew of Captain America. I was like, your uncle is Moises Silva. That's amazing. So uh, that just tells you I have a great respect for Moises Silva. I've never met him. He doesn't know who I am at all. <laughs> but I love his writings. I've learned a lot from them. And the one that I wanted to highlight today, again, is just understanding how words work, biblical words specifically, how we really understand their meaning, how their meaning relates to each other, and how to speak about that responsibly and not... Um, superficially and wrongly. So the title of the book again is Biblical Words and Their Meaning, An Introduction to Lexical Semantics by Moises Silva. Probably shouldn't um, read this book until you have at least an intermediate knowledge of Greek. So you would want to read this after two or three semesters of Greek. 